everything I know about love. I know that love can be loud and jubilant. It can be dancing in the swampy mud and the pouring rain at a festival and shouting, you are amazing, over the band. It's introducing them to your colleagues at a work event and basking in pride as they make people laugh and make you look lovable just by the dint of being loved by them. It's laughing until you wheeze. It's waking up in a country neither of you have been in before. It's skinny dipping at dawn. It's walking along the street together on a Saturday night and feeling an entire city is yours. It's big, beautiful, ebullient force of nature. I also know that love is a pretty quiet thing. It's lying on the sofa together drinking coffee talking about where you're going that morning to drink more coffee. It's letting them watch football when you'd rather be watching Selling Sunset. It's hanging up their laundry when they leave the house having moronically forgotten to take it out of the washing machine. It's saying, you're safer here than in a car as they hyperventilate on an easy jet flight to Dublin. <laughs> it's the text, hope your day goes well, how did today go, thinking of you today and picked up the loo roll. I know that love happens under the splendour of moon and stars and fireworks and sunsets, but it also happens when you're taking it in turns to sleep on the floor of your toddler's room when they have, have a cold, sitting in A&E or in the queue for a passport or in a traffic jam. Love is a quiet, reassuring, relaxing, pottering, pedantic, harmonious hum of a thing. Sometimes you can easily forget it is there, even though its palms are outstretched beneath you in case you fall.